Hello everyone, welcome back to another Raiders video. In this video, I'll be recapping the Raiders Broncos week five game. So let's get into it. So the Raiders got beat down by the Denver Broncos, 34 to 18. Very nasty performance. After a very good start, you know what I mean? A 10 0 start. There was a time in the game where the Raiders were up 10 3, but had the ball at the Denver five yard line after a really good drive. Um, then a play action pass. It was a well designed play, in my opinion. There's a guy wide open, which was Brock Bowers, and the play was missed. You know, Minshew missed him. And it ended in a 100 yard pick six, which tied the game at 10, instead of being 17 and 3. So the rest was kind of history. We got outscored for, you know what I mean? They scored, I think, 24 and answered after that. Or I guess 31 and answered, counting that pick six. But yeah, it was a really bad performance. After I thought we looked really good at the start, you know what I mean? The, the offense was clicking, the defense was doing what it was supposed to do on the, on the Denver offense, which is, you know, check, checking down the whole time. And after that pick six, we just lost momentum. Also made mistakes. You know what I mean? Could have been 10-10 um, at half, but instead it was 13-10 because we had a penalty on a field goal attempt. Then they came back and made the same five yard easier field goal and got three free points out of it. So mistakes all, all over the place. Three total turnovers in this game by us. None by them. Bo Nix looked like a good quarterback, even though he looked bad the first four games. But, you know, comes out 200 yards, two touchdowns. Our defense was supposed to make it take advantage of the fact that he's young and not playing that well, and he looked good against us. His best career game thus far was against us. So that was a nasty side to see. Wilkins with a nice sack early on, but got injured. They're not playing the second half. He's now on IR, which is really unfortunate. I think he'll come back at some point in the season, but who knows, who knows what we're going to look like by then. But the first five games of him on this big contract, I have, like, what, what we've seen from him. Great run defense. Of course, good flashes of pass rush as well. Good leadership as well. So I, I like what we've seen from him. Crosby with two sacks, doing his thing against the Denver Broncos like he usually does. Um, coming in after missing two days of practice, but playing really well. You know, he, he did his thing. The Denver offense was checking down for the majority of the first half, pretty much. But in the second half, they that's when they started turning it out. And they they beat us pretty well. You know I mean? 34 points. I guess 27 points on offense. Um but the the story of the other game was their defense on our offense. You know what I mean? Our offense was struggling out there. I mean, you could not get anything going. You know, down the road, got bench for Andrew O'Connell. O'Connell th came in, threw a pick, had some nice plays, but you know, garbage time, just like we saw in Carolina, or against Carolina, had a pick as well off the hands of Bowers. So, I thought Bowers looked really good. I thought I remember Dola had some nice runs. You know, I thought Madison didn't look too good, but was still better than Samir White uh, from, from what we've seen from him this season. So. The run game did not look good. Um, the pass game did not look good. I thought we got Bowers and Jacoby Myers involved, sure, but not not mounting that much. You know what I mean? Eighteen points with eight of them being garbage time. So it was really bad performance. We were both two and two coming into this game. Sure, they eventually had to beat us because you know we, we had eight in a row on them, but we had the same record as them. A couple weeks ago, they looked like they were dead, dead in the water, and now they dominated us. And now have a higher record than us. Now we're 0-2 in, in the division games this season. 2-3. and three. Now we have a tougher opponent in Pittsburgh coming up. Hopefully we're able to rebound. If Denver actually starts to rise, it's going to be unfortunate because I thought they were going to be the bottom of the barrel of our division. But now they're 3-2. Three and Three-game winning streak. Their defense playing really well. Elite. Their offense backing them up. So they, they might be a good team over there. Which would definitely prove me wrong, but... Hopefully that's, that's the case. Hopefully the Raiders can bounce back. I think the good news is Devontae Adams looks like he might be saying a Raider. Maybe. Who knows at this point. But Might be. Might be. That would definitely be huge. But anyway, that's my Raiders-Broncos. Week 5 game. Recap. I'm Marto. Thank you for watching.